I think in 1935 it became a cinema. So this would have been Elvis's childhood cinema through the 1940s. So then I came across an interview with a very close friend of Elvis when he was just 10, 11 years old called Sam Bell. Tupelo is the king's birthplace. Sam Bell once told me about some of the fond memories he and Elvis shared. It was segregated, you know, so one side, he'd go in the white side, he'd buy some popcorn, and I'd go in the black side, but when we got upstairs, uh, they had a little banner there and just separated the races, mm -hmm. and he'd just cross over there. So we'd sit in the aisle instead of using the seat. We'd sit in the aisle and we'd watch all the westerns and all that. I found a couple of interviews from Sam Bell. I've also found some news clips about the Lyric Cinema, and then this made me start looking into two pillows.